بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس فرسٹ آف آل لیٹ می ویلکم یو آن بورڈ ٹو دا ڈسٹینس لرننگ پروگرام آف پاکستان انٹرنیشنل اسکول دوہا قطر لیٹس گیٹ اسٹارٹ ود آر ٹوڈیز لیسن دیر از فاسٹ کنٹینیوس ٹینس Let's have a look at the learning objectives of our today's lesson. By the end of this lesson, you'll be able to know what are the uses and structure of past continuous tense. Number two, use past continuous tense with increasing accuracy in writing. And number three, convert sentences into negative and interrogative using the above said tense. Well, my dear students, when we talk about past tense, we know that the past tense is further divided into four subdivisions. Past indefinite tense, past continuous tense, past perfect tense, and past perfect continuous tense. Well, our targeted tense for this week is past continuous tense. Let's have a look at the uses of this tense. The past continuous tense is used to talk about something which happened before and after another action. Here is an example. The children were doing their homework when I got home. Number two, it is also used to talk about something that happened before and after a specific time. Here is an example. It was eight o'clock. I was writing a letter. It is also used to show that something con show that 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 something continued for some time. For example, everyone was shouting. All right, dear students. Let's move ahead with the structure of past continuous tense first. have a look at the structure of simple sentence subject plus was were as helping verbs or auxiliary verb then ing form of a verb ing form of verb means first form of verb plus ing and then in the end we place object for example they were selling their car a few days before they is the subject were helping verb selling ing form of a verb their car is an object aslam was dozing in the class during the lesson aslam subject was as helping verb dozing main form of a verb that is ing form of a verb negative sentence subject plus was were and then right after was were we place not the same ing form of a verb is used in negative sentences also and then object in the end example some boys were not collecting dry leaves now you see some boys is the subject were and then right after the helping verb were we have placed not and then ing form of a verb similarly interrogative sentences in interrogative sentences we bring helping verb was were in the beginning then we place subject then the same ing form of a verb then object and in the end we put question mark here is an example were people gathering at the station we have placed were in the beginning then after verb follows the subject then ing form of a verb then in the end we have put a question mark similarly were you calling me when i emailed you this afternoon well dear students i hope you have understood the definition the uses and also the structure of past continuous tense now it's your turn to apply your understanding of this 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 lesson here is task 1 for you you are supposed to change the verb in parenthesis by using past continuous tense in the following given sentences you also will be given these sentences in the form of a worksheet at the end of this lesson 
you are all supposed to do this task moving ahead you have task 2 here you are supposed to convert the given sentences into negative sentence here is a set of sentences which you are supposed to convert into negative similarly task 3 requires you to convert the given set of sentences into interrogative sentences. Likewise, you will also be provided both these set of sentences in the form of worksheets separately at the end of this lesson. You are supposed to do as required. Well, thank you very much and have a nice day. Allah Hafiz.